Before we get into the video, I need you guys to do me a favour. Number one, like the video. Also comment, let me know your thoughts on the case. Now I truly understand being a dealer or being in the business is murky territory, but for you to take a life over a dispute over a £10 bag of weed is pushing things to the realm of barbaric behaviour. On the 14th of January of this year, two brothers, 19 year old Aman Ansar, and 19 year old Sahil Ansar, who resided in the Springdale Avenue in Huddersfield, along with a fair teenager, Wahab Sarif, had walked over to 33 year old Calvin Seif's home at around 11 pm after their plans of heading to town had fallen through due to bad weather. Now, the plan was to go around to Calvin's home and take his stash, despite the fact it was alleged that Calvin was a family man who only dealt weed from his kitchen to support his family. Now, it was reported that Sahil Ansar knocked on Calvin's door. Calvin was in the kitchen at the time, while his partner, Louise, was in the living room. Their three young children were also at home at the time of the incident. Now, Wahab and Aman were outside at the time of the incident. Wahab actually took to the stand during trial and explained that he had no idea that things were about to turn fatal. So Sahil knocked on Calvin's door, a commotion ensued, and then the knocks turned into thrashing and cups break and the sober plates. Sir Hilden shouted in a panic for Amman to join, and then a struggle ensued. Now Calvin didn't know the people trying to barge into his home at first. However, Amman and Sir Hill were actually his neighbours. They all lived on the same road. One of the brothers ended up pulling out a large blade, and they used it on Calvin, targeting his stomach. They then went into the living room where Calvin's partner was, and then they demanded her mobile phone and told her to be quiet. Now a police and emergency services were called. Calvin's partner had actually taken her children and ran away to the neighbour's house looking for safety. Calvin was taken to hospital where he was given emergency services but sadly he was pronounced dead just 17 hours later. Now police then began the investigation and saw that Aman and Sahil along with Wahab were caught on CCTV going to Calvin's house. A search warrant was signed off and police went to Aman's house. However, the brothers were not there. Ironically, at the same time, Wahab had realised that Calvin had died and he donated to a GoFundMe page for his funeral. On the 18th of January, armed police went to Aman's relative's house and then they found the brothers at a property in Croft Court, Brig House. The brothers were arrested and detained and of course read their rights. And the brothers have been now found guilty of the M, while Wahab was found guilty of manslaughter and they are due to be sentenced on October 27th. Condolences. Stay safe. Safe.